All right, everyone. So I've just removed the old dressing from my patient. I, of course, applied clean gloves to perform that. So I now need to put my sterile gloves on. What I'll be doing next is removing my clean gloves and throwing them in the trash receptacle. I will then take the hand sanitizer packet that came in my dressing kit and I have it nice and handy so I can easily put some hand sanitizer on and make sure that my hands all have a good clean before I place my sterile gloves on. So I just want to do a good scrub of all surfaces of my hands. I'm singing happy birthday or Yankee Doodle to myself a couple times, making sure that I get all areas and remove any bacteria that could be on there and easy to remove. From there, I'm going to pick up my sterile gloves and I'm going to open the packet. So there's an easy peel back here, remembering that the contents is still sterile um, within the package here, so it's okay to touch the outside of this package with your hands. This is going to be trash. Remove any extra trash away from your area because we all know that space is limited. So I'm then going to open my gloves up, taking care not to touch my sterile field. I'm going to remove these flaps back. Again, I want to eliminate reaching over top of the sterile gloves. So we're going to place our dominant hand on first. I'm right-handed, so I'm going to open these up and I'm going to reach for my right hand first. So I'm going to grab just by the cup here with my left hand and I'm going to be reaching in an upward motion to put my glove on. So I don't want my fingers to inadvertently bang down on anything below me and contaminate the fingertips. So there's glove number one. For glove number two, we need to take our fingers and slide them underneath the cup. We want to go glove to glove when we're transferring over to the second hand. So I'm going to place my fingers underneath the cup. Again, I'm going to point my fingers in an upward direction, stretching out that cup a little bit so that I can get over the surface of my hand. And I'm going to place my gloves on. So let's say something that happens sometimes is one of our fingers doesn't go in very well. So what you can always do is after you get that glove on, remember your fingers are sterile. So you can take your sterile glove and you can pick that finger up and you can touch on the gloves and place your hand in. That's not going to contaminate anything and it just allows you to get the glove properly positioned so that you can have the dexterity to then perform your dressing change. After that, if you want to get this off your table, you can, but we can't touch it with our hands, right? Because it's not sterile. So if you want to just scoot it off using your elbow, or if you have another person in the room that can help you, that will allow you to have a little bit more surface area to work with. And then we, of course, need to pick that up off the floor when we're done.